A mother killed herself and her 22-month-old son while gripped with paranoia her ex-boyfriend was hunting her, an inquest has heard. Angel Hudson, 26, and Arthur Hudson Carty were found in a car at their home in Euxton, Chorley, Lancashire. Preston Coroner's Court heard both died from carbon monoxide poisoning. The inquest heard a suicide note said she feared for her safety because of ex Wayne Carty but he said he was just trying to find out where they were. Increasingly odd. The mother and son were found in the back seat of her car in their garage last August, months after going missing in Devon. Ms. Hudson had repeatedly moved around the country and changed her mobile phone each month in the belief her ex boyfriend was trying to find her. But Mr. Cardi told the inquest of his former partner's increasingly odd behavior before they split up, three weeks after their son was born. The court heard there was no evidence Mr. Cardi had threatened or harmed either mother or son. Miss Hudson, who had changed her name by deed poll from Katie Howe, moved from the family home in Basingstoke to live with her father in Tinmouth, Devon, in November 2012. She then left to live in Norfolk, before moving to Euxton in January of last year, using a different name, Sam Stone, before she was found dead with her son on August 13. Mr. Cardi had reported them missing months earlier to police, which the inquest heard was entirely appropriate, and had also tried to contact his ex through the courts 13 times to get access to his son. Shades of Paranoia Coroner Dr. James Adeli recorded a verdict that Miss Hudson took her own life and unlawfully killed her son. He said Miss Hudson's belief her ex had the ability to manipulate the police, child support agency and courts to his own needs had shades of paranoia. This was simply normal court processes, the coroner said. Mr. Cardi told the hearing, I did call police, not to harangue, chase down or anything else, but as a duty of care to my son. I had no idea what part of the country my son was living in. A serious case review into the deaths is still going on.